Hello there, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. So on this video, we're going to talk about PowerPoint table with rounded corners. And right here, I have a sample table for you. So basically, what we're going to do right here is, we will try and make sure those corners right there are going to be rounded. So let's try it out. First thing you're going to do is select the image or the table itself. Click on Control X. Again, that would be, let me just click that one. That would be Control X. And then click on the paste option, go for paste special. Look for the one that says SVG. If you don't have the SVG option since you're using the older version of Microsoft or PowerPoint, click on the Enhance Meta file. On my end, I have SVG, so I'll proceed with SVG. After clicking that SVG option, you're gonna have this one. Next thing you're gonna do is make sure that this is gonna be ungrouped. How to do that one? That will be Control Shift G. As you can see, if this is an imported picture, just make sure you click on yes. One more time, click on Control shift g We're going to have this one right there. That would be again, Control shift g We have ungrouped it. Next part, for this one, you're seeing those corners right there, right? Please just make sure you delete those corners right there. We have four lines or four edges to delete them. We're going to end up with this one. Next up, go to insert. Look for the one that says shapes and then rounded corners. Make sure you choose rounded corners. And basically for this one, just make sure you're going to be selecting it as it is, making sure the edges touches the one you're creating. Like this one right here, I think this should be good enough. Just to make sure, let me just check it. Perfect. I think this is perfect. Next up, change the fill option to white. And then basically send to back. So we're gonna have this one right here. On the bottom section, we have it already around it. Our problem would be these two right here, right? Let's start with the left one. On the left one, go on the shape format. Look for edit shape. Look for change shape and look for the one that says single corner rounded. You'll notice on the right side it has been rounded, right? So make sure you click on rotate and flip horizontally. Perfectly right there. It's going to be changed on that part right here. So to change it, just simply click on the yellow dot. You're going to see that one. Just pull it up and align it on the rounded corner we have added earlier. Perfect. And right now, we have it somewhat similar, but we can make it as close to perfect as we can, right? Again, this is still not going to be perfect. It's still not going to be 100%. It's going to be our skill and own perspective to make this work. I think this should be good enough. So right now, we have a rounded corner, right? Next up, you can still make sure this is fit to work. As you can see right there, you can edit still the rounded corner we have added earlier. If you're not satisfied with it, just make sure you click it one more time. And then basically proceed until you see the one you're looking for. I think this should be good enough. So what we did earlier for this one, let's just do the same for this one. Click on shape format, go to edit shape, change shape for that one, and choose the one that says single corner rounded. For this one, you don't have to flip it because it's around in the right side. Just basically have some patience and look for the edges until they successfully align to your liking. And basically for this one, the final touches would be just making sure it looks good. As you can see right there, you can do this, do that, going back to the corners or our topic for today follow it as it is i think this should be good enough so what's next now basically we're done here we're just adding some finishing touches for example this one right here you can change the color fill for this one for example let me just click the fill there you want that one to be blue you want that one to be a little bit more yellow that's going to be depending on your own choosing same goes for this one as you can see right there i can change it to orange all right, and basically we're done here. Again, if you still want to design it, that's going to be depending on your own perspective. Have fun with it, and please hit the like button and subscribe. I'll catch you on the next one. Goodbye for now.